This game was an absolute banger. Damian Lillard, 44 points, 9 assists, and 5 rebounds, along with the game winning 3, which you're going to see in a couple of seconds or in a couple of minutes, whatever you want to call it. But look at this. Simons with a good drive, good pass, good swing, good shot from the corner from Dame Dalla, making another one. Now, they're up by 7. But there's Zach Levine. He had a big game tonight. 31, or sorry, 26 points. Laurie Markkinen had 31 points. Kobe White with 20 of them. There's Simons knocking down the three-pointer. He had eight points. 22 points for Enos Kanter. 11 rebounds as well. Garrett Chen Jr. had 18 points. As you see, the three from the corner. They're a good shot. It's a four-point game. Bulls with the basketball. Bulls. Good look inside. And he's going to finish. Laurie Markkinen gets the lay. That was an and one. Now it's a one point game, eight minutes left. Here come the Bulls again. Levine just gonna split it. Good find in the corner. Sadoransky knocks down another three. He had two threes tonight, six points. Now here goes Zach Levine, they're up by two. He's gonna hit that mid range. You know he likes that shot, gets right to it. The Bulls are gonna be seven and 11 after this L. The Blazers will be 10 and eight as you see Dame Lillard pulling from deep. You gotta get over the screen, you cannot go under. Now, Anis Cantor with the spin move that was a nice move right there put him on skates it's a four point game with five minutes left but good swinging garrett temple wide open loses his balance but he still makes a three it does not matter shoot or shoot good shot from him nine points tonight now there's in the corner laurie marketing making the three ties the game up at 113 a piece here go the bulls good passing laurie marketing with another point it's a two point lead for the bulls now they're up two with the ball, a minute left. Zach Levine with a layup gives them up a four point lead, but here comes Damian Lillard. He's gonna knock down this shot. Well, here's Covington getting a layup first. Good finish from him. Now look at this. The Bulls, they're gonna force a jump ball. And they're, they're sorry, the Blazers force a jump ball. They win it and they get it. Damian Lillard is gonna get the ball from Covington. Step back three over Laurie Markin and wins the game. Lillard, 44 points and the game winner. He's done that so many times in his career. Blazers win. Another great game in the NBA. A lot of good games tonight, but too many to cover in one video with the video. You know what I mean? Suns are going to get their second win straight. No Devin Booker still, but Chris Paul's been picking up the slack. 29 points, 13, or sorry, 12 assists tonight. He's been playing well. They're now 10 and 8, the Suns. Mavericks have lost five in a row. They're 8 and 12. As you see, Tim Hardaway Jr. with a good pass inside. They're up by two here. Luka had 29 points, 7 assists, 8 rebounds tonight. Hardaway Jr. had 19. DeAndre Ayton with 18 points and 17 boards. Langston Galloway, 12 points. Mikhail Bridges, 14 points. Jay Crowder, 13, 14 points. Everyone play well for Phoenix today. As you see, they're down two here. But here comes Chris Paul, point god in the coop. He hits the three-pointer to give them a one-point lead. Chris Paul has been great for the Suns. And obviously, I mean, you can see the impact of Chris Paul. They're, you know, they're going to make the playoffs this year. And they haven't done that for a, the entire existence of Devin Booker on the Suns. So, shout out to him. That's why Chris Paul's a top point guard of all time. Top three of all time. Actually, I don't know about top three. Top five of all time. Now, Chris Paul just doing his work. Easy mid-range. He's had that shot in his back for over 10 years now. How do you guard it? I don't know. CP3 in the coup. Now, Chris Paul again. Good pass to Aiden. One of his 12 assists. They're up by 6 with a minute 10 left. And look at this run they're going on. Chris Paul again. Good pass to Jay Crowder. Bang for 3. 9 point game. And this one's going to be all but over. Here comes Luka. He's going to get a layup. Nice little finish on the left side with the right hand. But what does it mean at this rate? Nothing. Because the Suns, they're up 7. That's game. Alright, last game of the day is probably the best game of the day. Actually, no, the Blazers one was the best. But let me go over the other games first. Rockets beat the Pelicans 126 to 16. Search chart to 112. Eight Christian Wood at 27 points. Oladipo with 20. Heat beat the Kings 105 104. Jimmy Butler in his return from COVID 19 at 30 points, 8 assists, and 7 rebounds. The Hornets beat the Bucks. Lamella Ball 27 points, 9 assists, 5 rebounds. Gordon Hayward at 27 as well. Grizzlies. They're finally back from the quarantine they've been on. They won five in a row now after today. Uh, D'Anthony Milton with 20 points and a W over the Spurs. And then finally, the Warriors, they beat the Pistons by a lot. Curry with 28 points, 7 assists, 5 rebounds. Anyway, let's get to this game. This one was a good one. Lakers and the Celtics. The Lakers are going to take this W by one point. 
Anthony Davis, 27 points, 14 rebounds. LeBron, 21 points, 8 assists, 7, sorry, 7 assists, 7 rebounds. And Montrezl Harrell at 16 points off the bench. Tatum had 30 points. Jalen Brown with 28. Tice with 14. As you see, they're up by 3 here. This is the Lakers are LeBron facing up Daniel Tice. Just going to knock a 3 down. He's been shooting the 3-ball well this season. LeBron, early case for MVP. He always is. But he never seems to win it because this team is always good. Uh, I don't even know. I guess he just gets overlooked. I don't know. Should LeBron win MVP? Let me know. As you see, Harrell with the steal. Now, Harrell's going to get rewarded for the hard work with the flush. LeBron with the assist. It's a six-point lead for the Lakers. But the Celtics, they're not going down without a fight. <laughs> Jalen Brown, good pass to Tatum. He hits the layup. Now, it's a four-point game. What will happen? Well, Janice Schroeder will get an and one. That's what will happen. Puts the Lakers up by 7 with a minute 40 left. But here come the Celtics. It's a 5-point game. Now Tatum crossing up AD. Good fade away. That's what I like to see from Tatum. Take it. It's your team. Now 3-point game. Lakers, they're trying to put this one away. LeBron, he's just going to get a turnover. Celtics get the ball back. It's a 3-point game. Here they go. Tatum to the hoop. He's going to get another two-pointer. It's a one-point game now. They need to play defense, and they're going to do just that. Look, they strip it from Anthony Davis. Good defense from the Celtics here, but look at Kemba. He's going to miss the game winner, as you're going to see. Jalen Brown, he gets it up there. Jalen Brown back to Ojale to Kemba. He gets his pull-up signature shot. No good, and the Lakers win, and that's going to do it for this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.